Hey, friends and family. So I was trying to do a live video, but my phone does garbly weird things. So I guess I am just going to record this video and I'll post it later. So thank you for those of you that did tune in to the live one. That's awesome. So I'm really excited to, to share this because I know during this time with the lockdown and all the stuff, people have lost their jobs, they're worried about money and stuff. So you want to support people, especially people you love and care about, but you know, money might be tight, so you can't really buy their products. You can't, you know, maybe you're busy with your kids at home, so you don't have time to join their live selling events or whatever and um so you just you're happy for them yay and you just you can't participate and you can't pay and nobody you know expects you to and so don't pressure yourself to put money out when you can't but i have exciting news there are ways that you can support your friends and your family in their businesses for free it's really easy and it's fun and it gives you these feeling good chemicals because one of the greatest human needs is to contribute, to give. And it, you know, when you give someone a gift, I learned this, I mean, I know this anyway. I've always loved giving people gifts and cards for their birthdays and stuff. But, I mean, you know, when you give someone something, their reaction and, and you, just the act of giving it makes you feel so good, right? And so you want to give to someone in, in that way so it and it makes you feel really good makes them feel really good it's a win-win situation yay who don't we love those win-win so okay so one of the things that really will help especially if your friend it has a Facebook business page like I have a lot of friends who have these wonderful businesses like Arbon, Mary Kay, um, Tupperware, um, paparazzi jewelry um, landscaping businesses, handyman businesses, uh, mine I'm going into coaching all this stuff. So if they especially have a public page, a like page, which is the page that is for their business, not their personal profile. So not their name and their personal stuff where they post their dog and their cat and their happiness and things. Those, those private things are on their personal profile. But on their business page, they're talking about their business. So sometimes they post a picture. Sometimes they put like in landscaping, they'll post a beautiful yard they did or something. Or sometimes they will post a little video clip. Or sometimes they will actually go live and show you behind the scenes or whatever's going on. Sometimes, and some businesses are online. Like one of my beautiful friends sells paparazzi jewelry, which is badass, and it's cheap. Oh! So, anywho, she goes live. So, on the live thing, you could go shopping from your couch for cheap. Anywho, so what i want to help with is a lot of the time before i got into my own business i didn't realize there were things i could do to help somebody and the way that algorithms work with facebook and stuff like that they really keep businesses stifled unless you pay and if you pay it helps but still there's things that will help their business and it doesn't cost you a thing okay so first when you're scrolling and we're all on facebook all day can't tell me nobody isn't because we all are. So, Facebook all the time, right? Do, do, do. That's our entertainment. We're on Facebook. Okay, so your friend's post goes by. Your landscaping friend with this wonderful photo. Don't just pass by. Go, oh, that's nice. No. Put a heart. Don't just like, which works anyway. Any of the reactions work, <laughs> seriously. But put a heart. It feels good. Makes them feel good. Makes you feel good. It's love. Okay. So do that, even if you don't even read the caption. But please read the caption. Anywho, so put a heart and keep scrolling on back. Okay, easy peasy. What does that do? It shows Facebook, oh, this business has something interesting. Okay, cool. I might open them up a little bit so more potential customers can see. Okay, then here's another wonderful thing you can do. Comment. So even if you don't have time at the moment, you can put a heart in the comment or you can type in um, good job or something if you didn't pay attention or whatever just if it's a picture it's pretty easy you can just beautiful nice work right comment that gets Facebook's attention even more so comment and if it's a video um, of any kind but if it's a live video that you're watching the replay of if you do no other comment at all 
type hashtag replay. That way they know you saw this later and that will help the person see that maybe going live at 3 a.m. is not good for this time zone, especially if their business is local. So they'll learn when their popular times are. They can look at that at stats too. But anywho, if you put a comment, that is very helpful. And if you actually watch the video, whether it's live or pre-recorded like this one, you watch the entire video. And actually a good practice is maybe if you really want to get into it, don't hit the heart or comment until the video is like halfway through. And then we'll stay till the end and comment again or put another thing. And something I like, if it's alive, and you see sometimes a lot of my teammates, we hit heart, 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 and all these hearts go flying. It's a lot of love, but it's like the equivalent of applause, right? It's so cool. So especially your friends in the music industry, give them a lot of love, a lot of applause, because they haven't been able to perform out in venues in forever. And it really helps to keep their enthusiasm high so they can do their wonderful gift of creating music for you, which makes you feel good, right? So that really helps. And another wonderful thing you can do that costs you nothing, if you loved what you saw. I mean, we're all good at sharing um, music videos, cat videos, things like that that we love, funny videos, we'll share them. But if your friend did a great job on their post, on their video especially, but on the post, the, the photo, whatever it is, if they're having a sale, whatever it is, if they are, if they did a good job and you liked it and it touched you and you think somebody else could benefit from it and it might help, share it. Just share it. Hit share. Say, hey, my friend's doing this. I thought it was great. That's all you got to do. And then that person gets to, their post goes to your friends and family who get to see, who might also share or purchase or utilize the surface or whatever their business is. So it really helps to get the word out. And the more these things happen, the more Facebook will see or the, the algorithm will see, hey, this business is something that more people want to see right on. So they open it up further to more people. You'll be surprised if you have, say, um, I don't know, let's just pick a number, 500 subscribers or followers on your business page. The, they don't all see it. So Facebook will only show to a very small percentage of that. So the way that businesses get their word out there is by shares and comments and stuff because then the algorithm keeps seeing like, hey, okay, this person, this business is pretty good. Let's open it up a little more. Let's open it up a little more. And that is how you get the person to have help with their business. And it's free. It costs you nothing. It feels wonderful to do. And you know sometimes, especially people in my industry, sometimes our live videos go on for like an hour or whatever. So you may not have time to watch it right then. So make a note in your calendar on your phone or something. And some evening when you are relaxing at home, ready to watch Netflix or something, you know, get your popcorn ready and stuff. Play your friend's video, their business video. Check it out. It might be fun, right? It's just like watching TV. And also something else really cool that I learned is even if you're busy, like if you're cleaning the house on a Saturday, go to your friend's video. If you don't want to watch it, if it's a topic that doesn't interest you or whatever, go to your friend's video, their business video, hit play, walk away, go clean your house. They will get the credit for the full duration view. How beautiful is that? You're getting your house clean while you're helping your friend. Win, win. So hopefully these tips have helped you. And hopefully uh, we can all start supporting our friends' businesses because especially at times like now, we all need the support and the love, especially now more than ever. So here's to all of our success. There is abundance in the universe. And if we work together and spread the love, we can all be successful and happy and feel the joy and benefit. There's really no downside. Okay, love you guys. Thank you so much. Please hit the heart, hit like, and this wasn't a live, so you don't have to say replay. 
but give me a comment. Let me know if this helped you. Did you learn anything from this video that will um, help you in the future to help other people? Let me know. I really appreciate it. And to everyone who is doing their best to thrive, I say keep going. You are doing a fabulous job. The world needs whatever it is you are offering, whether that is being a good parent, whether that's being a good friend, whether that's your business, whether that's your, your job, doing the best job you can for your company, whatever it is, keep doing fabulously because the world needs it. Okay, love you lots.